everybody. So I'm back and this week, as promised, I am going to be discussing a little more lighthearted book, a little more humorous for us all because I think we could all use a laugh right about now. So this week's book is Good Omens by Neil Gaiman and Terry Pratchett. Um, Neil Gaiman is Confession Time, a bit of an author crush of mine. I adore him and all of his work. Usually his books are a little more on the spooky, scary side. This one, I think it's the combination with uh, Terry Pratchett that makes it a little more just humorous and lighthearted. I say that it is about the apocalypse, <laughs> which I think we're all starting to know a little something about. Um, and it, it takes place, uh, there's an angel and a demon who are narrating it, and they are responsible for bringing about the downfall of planet Earth. But they have lived here for some time and they have grown somewhat enamored with the human species and aren't so thrilled about the idea of ending our world. Uh, they do have the baby Antichrist and he becomes misplaced in the hospital and hilarity ensues. Um, I find the book to be just laugh out loud, satire, um, and the apocalyptic stuff. There is, <laughs> there is something reminiscent about what's happening outside our doors these days. So uh, it's relatable, but very funny and clearly you know, meant to be taken in jest, tongue in cheek. Um, also, as a bonus, they last year made this into a TV series on Amazon Prime. So while the book is available both on Overdrive, both as an audio and uh, an ebook, you can also, after you've read it, watch the TV show, which stars David Tennant and who does not love him. Um, and Neil Gaiman helped to write it, so it is very well done. I enjoyed it very much. However, I am sticking with the book as my favorite like a good librarian. Um, so you could do a little page to screen, check out the book and then check out the TV show and see which you prefer. And I'd love to hear about it. Um, I, as usual, miss you all very much. We cannot wait to get back into the library and see, your all, see all of your smiling faces again. So I hope that you're all staying safe and healthy and just as excited to get back in the library as we are. And I will be back next week with another pick. Thanks so much.